Hello, Britt. Hi. What do you want? Black hair. You want black hair. So this video is all about uh, coloring your hair from uh, ultra platinum blonde to black hair. Yes. First thing I'm going to do is to show the people what hair you have. So will you turn around, please? And the next thing I'm going to do is to bring pigment into your hair. So that's the first step we make. Okay. Brit wants black hair in <laughs> summertime. And if Brit wants something, she wants something. Yes. <laughs> Starting with protection. First, I'm going to make a color into her hair so you all so see how red hair suits her. That's the nice thing because the first color I'm going to bring in is a red. This I'll do on conditional base. I will use a shampoo and a conditioner. Both products are from uh, Lacme. This is a red conditioner and red shampoo. Direct colors, so they bring a red pigment into the hair. And I need some pigment to uh, base my color on, otherwise it don't uh, hold on the hair. Of course I put on my own protection. One on one conditioner and shampoo. Mix them together and applying them on the hair. And when this is on the hair, there's no turning back uh, for the blonde because now the only thing you can have is a, a, a totally hard pink color. When you rinse it out. Like a cold? Yeah, it's nice cold. I color a lot with conditioners because when young girls want to change colors a lot, the nice thing about Lacme colors is that they have uh, more than six colors in conditioner and shampoo. So it's very nice to change your colors with that. This I will let work it in for about uh, 50 minutes, then rinse it out and then come back to, you to show how I put the color on and what kind of color I will put into her hair. I think that everyone will think of uh, Brit with zwart, how then? I will stoer away that, I think. Yeah, I think that it's softer than a bit of it. Yeah, then it's softer. Now I massage the product into her hair, so I'm certain that all hair has a red pigment. This I leave on for 50 minutes, then rinse it out with not too warm water because I need protection on the skin. And then I'll be back to put the black on. Dat ja, als je het met koeler water was, dat die vette lagen niet zo afgaan. Ja. Oké. Okay. Close my foil. And we're back in 50 minutes. Oké, okay, this is the color after uh, just shampoo and uh, red conditioner. So it looks like this. I will uh, dry it a little bit because otherwise it's too wet. Put nothing in it. So you see how wonderful this uh, shampoo conditioner colors. So it's normal that once you would have somebody who wants it just for temporary, uh, temporary uh, coloring, it, that you can do it like this. This would fade away till it's an ultra light uh, pink color and then it uh, goes out of the hair. But that takes about uh, a week or three, even in the summertime. But now I'm certain I have pigment to hold my color on.
We rinse it out with uh, not too warm water. That because the protection of the skin is still uh, on the skin and not all is uh, rinsed away. Okay, I made for a color. It's a, a zero, uh, one uh, point zero. It's a black. I put a deep conditioner in. Of course, I need my protection because otherwise I have black hands. When I would use a uh, blue black, it's possible that you get a bit, little bit purple shade in it because there's a red in it. When you use um, a black, totally black, then you only have, of course, a black color. Going to apply it from one side to the other. The conditioner I mixed into it is uh, of Goldwell, they have a new product to uh, get into the color. It goes in two steps, so afterwards I will put a step two in the sink and that uh, binds with the conditioner that is now in the color. The black I made with uh, 6%, so that's 20 volume. Now there's no turning back. Half black. <laughs> Work from one side to the other and back. And so I apply all the color on her hair. Now I've got all the color on my hair. When I rinse this out, I use towel with a little bit shampoo number one. This to uh, get the color off of the skin. I have to uh, comb the hair through because then I'm certain that the color is everywhere and there's no red left and also of course no <laughs> X blonde. But I'm certain of that, that that is gone, it's all red. This I cover up in my plastic foil, wait for uh, 20 minutes without heat because now in the saloon it is totally warm. It's Holland, uh, summertime, so you don't need extra heat. 20 minutes, rinse it out and then I'll show you the end result. I'm so excited! Yeah, you're right. Sorry. It's warm. It's studio. Yeah. yeah. We're back from uh, coloring black. After 30 minutes, we did it without heat. We rinsed it out. We used the conditioner of uh, Goldwell and we put a step two in it. And step two, the step one is a conditioner you put into the uh, color that uh, creates a new binding with uh, the proteins in the hair. Step two, uh, fits it together so it don't get out of the hair. So that's what I used. Um, now I'm going to blow dry it so you can see how wonderful black suits her. First I take a new product of Rover hair and that's, I love to, to combine with products that you already know when you're watching my videos. This uh, gives volume to the hair. Blow dry it with a big brush. I start in the neckline, so you can see. The hair is now in a wonderful condition, so don't need to cut it. So far blow drying, now I'm going to clean the contour a little bit.
Brit has a on the neck shave, a nape shave. It's not the shortest anymore, but it's still in a wonderful line. Side shaves. So I only do this with my small wild uh, clipper. To finish the style, I will use a product of uh, Lanza. I will use the oil. This to give even more condition to the hair and give it also a bit of punky feeling but still wonderful flowing because the hair is in a wonderful condition now and still <laughs> after all we've done and this is Brit's new color hairstyle of course is the same but now you know how to color from ultra light to black without getting strange colors. Yes. <coughs> How does it feel? Good. Good? Feels good. Yes. Brit, will you turn for you and the rest of the world to show the end result? And when you turn once more, will you show the neckline? How we did your nape shave and the side shaves? Wonderful. Thank you very much. Thank Looks you. good on you, Black. <laughs> Wonderful eyes you have. I love you. I love you too. Thank you.